the iMac G3, the only Mac for education. Back then in 1993, or would I say, for short, 2003, because that's why they called it the G3. Now let's turn this bad boy on and see what he can do from back in 2003, from 1993 to 2003. Let's turn him on. The one problem about this old computer is there was no webcam. There was good speakers though. But the problem is this is the old Tiger version so you're looking for a good screen. You would not be able to find a good screen here because the screen is just not that good. And it's pretty slow. You can't connect to the internet unless you have a firewire because you can connect from down on that side. But otherwise, it's a pretty good computer for education if you don't want a very old computer. But otherwise, it's a good computer that was for a old price for a lot of price back then. And it also supported OS 9 and Mac OS X. Oh yeah, go check out my YouTube channel. I'm just joking. Don't check it. You can check it if you want to though. As if I zoom in here. You'll see all this Mac OS 9 stuff. The Mac OS 9 is actually an old software. And as you can see, it says you're emulating it. So technically, you're starting up the Mac instead of a Mac. And yes, it's a system thing built in. You don't actually have to worry about setting up anything. So, just starting up all your applications down here. All over the mouses. Those are all the applications that load in. And that's the original OS that came with it. You can stop it, but I don't really recommend stopping it. I recommend just waiting for OS 9 to, to start, but we're talking about OS X here, so this is just running in the background. They also call it Classic Startup on the top left. Okay, now that we're in here, you can see I have video files here. They're just screen recording. But you can also read text files. Good for making file formats. So if I open up a text file, you see it's a lot of text. I haven't made this one. Uh, you also get a uh, browser called Safari, as you can see here on the bottom left. And Safari is just a straightforward screen recorder slash internet thing. I'm not sure why it says screen recorder, but you see you got your browser here. You got Google. I don't know why it says 2016, but it says 2016 right there. And sorry for the black line, you can see that. Let me just zoom out. Okay, now you can see that the whole screen here is offline because if I click on searching, it will say, server not found. Oh wait, you're not connected to the internet. So I press okay. They're like, wait, how are you connected to the internet? All I have to do is go to Safari and check out the version. You're on version 1.1. Yes, that is version 1.1 of Safari. That is pretty old, version 100, from 2003 as you can see right there. But otherwise that's Safari there, and you're wondering, wait, Safari on here doesn't work. Yeah, but also guess what else works? Internet Explorer from the 2009 version, I mean not 2009, it wasn't even made in 2009, what am I talking about? The uh, 1990 whatever version. If you look on that, it will actually open up another version of it, but Internet Explorer 5 Macintosh edition. You can still download this nowadays, but you need this old firmware. As you see, when you drag it around, you get this old square. But also, you get this home button. So it'll just say, error. You got this message here. You can't do this. Next. And previous. It's the same thing. That's okay. And the cool thing is, this is where the accessory Macintosh Mac.ie comes in. Yes, there is a green Macintosh icon. This is for full screen, or minimize, full screen, and the X, of course. And another cool thing is you can check out your folders, but you have no Wi-Fi, you just have to go to the Wi-Fi, this is my Wi-Fi right here, there. Choose your password or any kind of format you have, and add to keychain, keychain is technically your password saver. Type in your random password that way I don't have a keyboard for this for this computer. I know I'm pathetic, I don't have a keyboard. You can check your music, you download them from the web. Yes, all these songs. And I love this little scroll bar on the far right here. You can just scroll, but they don't sadly don't have this anymore. 
Oh, great. Look at this. Lied at me. You know, this whole thing. Yeah, I have lied at me in here. Some reason there are pings. You can set backgrounds to that. See, so it's the D3. You do get network. You get your untitled hard drive. You get all your OS 9 applications here. Make sure you're locked. It's an old one. What applications here where you get all your decent applications? But as you see, you get iMovie, you get Halo. You're like, how can you play Halo on here? It just doesn't want to load. Same with this. It loads, but then it crashes. iMovie HD does work though. But it says incompatible. It's so old. You don't know what version this is? Here we go. Fingertips of all things. Okay, it's version 10.3. That means this is Jaguar. Jaguar was a good successful version of Mac. So that's that version of the iMac G3. Let's move on to, uh, what do you call it? The iMac G4. See you guys there. Check out these stats. Firewire, that's old. Well, whatever. Let's move on. I can't. 